What do you think happens to the consciousness of the people that are dying in the days coming up to their death? I, I think what they're doing is, and that's what we try and help a person to do, is, is to let go of the body. If the body is not going to work anymore, that to let, let it go. To, like we've had low, in the death doula training too, they give you lots of examples of you know, near death um, situations where people actually saw something and went towards the light. And I'm, I'm hoping it's like that. It'll be, you know, that'll, I, could, I could do that. I could do that going to the light and you know, mm. letting go of the body. But I think when the person, if you've experienced death yourself, you do. There's an energy around, especially in Ireland, the way we do wakes. There's an energy around it. There's a, there's a, a reverence and a, and a kind of a, a... Like, I remember my, one of my father's things where always when somebody died was open the window to let the soul go, mm. uh, to let the soul out of the body. Old Irish traditions, covering mirrors. Um, like, back in the day, sure, we, um, we used to bring people in to Keen at funerals. To, like, they were almost... They were like, hired almost into to mm. Keen at funerals. So we have a big death tradition in Ireland. Yeah. Have you thought about your death, Tommy? Yeah, I started to think about it recently, and the thing that have, has uh, come into my mind is what will I leave behind? Yeah. And that I often find myself sitting in the sitting room and go, OK, there'll be a day when mm. I won't be here, mm. and, but all the others will be. Yeah. And I'll just be gone. Mm -hmm. And what will they... What will I have left and what, what memories will I have left them and what practical things will yeah. I have left them? And, uh, yeah, I'm thinking about that. And then you start thinking about, OK, well, why not put some effort into uh, good things Love rather that. than just... Because most of us are just living all the time and we're, you know, grabbing this, grabbing that and surviving and getting on and moving. But to think about... To actually think about, OK, What'll be left behind me when I go? Yeah. It's. Yeah. What imprint will you leave? Pardon? What imprint will you have left? Yeah, I and mean, you can't always control that. No, you cannot. Life dictates you know. a lot of it. But you know what I think, Tommy? Like, we, if I asked you how much money you had, would you tell me? No, but oh, if, no. I asked, if, you asked, <laughs> if you asked anybody how much money they had, yeah. they'd have a fair idea. We know how much money we have, we don't know how much time we have.